So we kicked off this morning at 8 o'clock with uh, some client-based fringe events uh, for breakfast and they were all standing room only, which was a very good start to the day. Uh, we then moved on to our opening plenaries, which were kicked off by Steve. And I think we had 800 people in the auditorium, which was record numbers for us for the beginning of the base show. And then it seems to have got better and better all morning and the vibe has built. And I think uh, with these things, there's only a vibe if people are enjoying it, they're finding new opportunities. And I think what we've always said is this is a market that people should get involved with. And there seems to be plenty of evidence that uh, they're enjoying getting involved with it. So in many ways, BASE has done its job or doing its job. And let's hope there are many more jobs it needs to do along these lines going forward. This morning really brought together the importance of addressing climate change and the opportunity that exists for London and how important it is to get finance into projects that can really stimulate the economy and address some of the uh, energy challenges that we have. Base London is an incredibly important event uh, for London. It brings together businesses. It's about helping the Mayor deliver his ambitions for London around investment growth particularly in the property centre uh, sector and particularly around uh, buildings and developments. I spoke this morning about the role of digital technology in reducing the carbon footprint of cities, an initiative called the Green Digital Charter supported by the European Union, which up to now 30 cities have signed up to to help them reduce their footprint by 2020. Those cities are like Amsterdam and Copenhagen and it's helping them use te digital technology to reduce their footprint and actually improve the lives of citizens. Well, I think the, key, uh, the, the main key information is about uh, the direction of London. What is the city is going to be in the next um, 10 years, 20 years, further in time. So it's very interesting to know the direction. So we can, for example, I'm from IKEA, we can know uh, what, how we operate in the market. London Rebuilding Society is here because we provide finance for people who can't access finance in London, particularly in the areas of energy efficiency and green retrofit. This is a fantastic opportunity for us. It's a chance to be in a place where there are very large numbers of organisations, commercial organisations, corporates, public sector, who are interested in what we're doing. It's been a fantastic event today, really exciting. Uh, we've met some fantastic prospects and clients as well. Economics, we offer a turnkey solution to our clients to help identify and implement energy efficiencies and technologies into their buildings, creating, them, creating sustainability and energy reductions. For us, this has been great to see what's happening in the industry, London in particular, which is one of our key focuses, and really see what's happening across the board. So, no, it's been a fantastic day. Thoroughly enjoyed it. Today has been a really valuable day for me. I've had the opportunity to network with a lot of very interesting new and innovative technology providers, um, some of which will definitely be included in our portfolio of new business going forward. Um, it's an event we're definitely going to add to our calendar next year and one that I would thoroughly recommend to others.